Connor McNeil here with Georgian Bay Yacht Sales by United City Yachts, Canada's largest yacht sales network. And today we're gonna to be going aboard this 2020 Stanley 26 closed wheelhouse pulse craft. This is a beautiful boat. I can't wait to show it to you guys today. So this boat is listed at Carling Bay Marina, just south of Perry Sound, Ontario. Right now we just got in the water, just came out of winter storage where it's stored inside for the winter season. Let's have a quick look at the exterior of the boat. A lot has been customized about this boat. So this is the 26 foot pulse craft. But let's take a look at the back of the boat right away. And we've got twin F250 engines. This boat package either comes with single engine or you can upgrade to have the dual 250s. I prefer the dual, especially on a boat like this where you're gonna be hauling a bunch of equipment. You want the extra power to get you there. Step aboard the boat here. So this boat does have the electric bow gate with just a simple push of a button right down here. You can lower the gate, drops down electronically. You can lower that down, load all your equipment in. You can bring in, whether you're doing a backhoe or some lumber, you can drive right on. And uh, this boat also does have the ice and grounding package. So you can either beach the boat or drive it through a little bit of ice. Plenty of storage in the gunnels on either side. There are two doors that also lift up here. So that piece lifts up and then there's more storage behind. Nice bench seat forward. Also does have a cushion for it. And then there's storage beneath there. Now for boarding, you've got a port side gate as well as a starboard side gate if you'd like to uh, board from either side. Now let's take a look at the custom closed wheelhouse on this. So what's custom about it is it has been widened to fit the entire width of the boat here. We've got an 8.3 beam with 26 feet overall in length, but uh, the cab here has been widened. You've got dual access on either side. So you can see the two doors that I have open right now. And then you also have the rear facing door. Lots of really good grab points around the boat. You've also got all of the tie down points. So if you do have equipment in here, you can strap it down. We've got tie down points all throughout the boat here. Now let's make our way inside the cabin aboard this boat. So nice seating all the way around the cabin. Really good cushions on it too. So for electronics on board this boat, we have a seven inch Garmin display. You've got the Yamaha multifunction command link as well so that would give you the uh, feedback from your dual engines and then you've got your throttles over here so all electronic easy to shift all in one and then your bilge pump as well as you've got your light controls here so we have nav lights anchor light wipers spreader lights which are the led spreader lights on board and then accessories which will control your electronics we've also got a garmin vhf radio up at the top here And you can see a really nice cushion with backrest. Now for lights inside, we do have two lights up on the top. They also are red and, uh, and white lights, as you can see. Now going back to the rear facing door here, we do have a bench seat laying down, but you could easily lift that bench seat. And then you have really nice access to the transom of the boat. A little bit of storage, batteries are down below there as well. And a little bit of storage down there. You got your batteries and battery switches. And then making our way out, got the rear tow post, definitely a must have. And then you've got the dual engines. So these are Yamaha F250s with 60 hours on them, stainless steel props. And then of course the dual motor mount bracket. And then you have power steering as well as dual batteries for that. To the right side, we've got the telescopic reboarding ladder as well. You can see a few more grab handles and cleats, and then you've got your fuel fill up back here as well. Now inside the cab again, we've got plenty of storage beneath all the seats. So that little black piece there pops out and then you've got storage underneath that seat, storage under the back bench seat there, and then storage on the port side of the boat and this port side bench seat. Again, that black tab just picks up and then you've got a big storage locker underneath. Sliding windows. 
and those go for either side of the boat. Making our way back out, we'll go towards the bow again. You can see plenty of space here. Then you have also some mounts for downriggers. Now, if you'd like a private tour of this boat, you can contact me by email, which is connor at georgianbayyachtsales.com, or you can visit our website for the full listing. It'll have the full spec write up on the boat for everything that we know about it, as well as access to uh, the 360 photos and, of course, this virtual tour. Now, if you have any questions about the listing, you can either contact me by email, you can contact me through the listing, or you can call me directly on my cell phone at 705-427-9025. I'd love to get you aboard and show you this beautiful boat. It's a single owner, very low hours, and really, really well maintained. It'd be the perfect boat for any contracting work or hauling that you need to do around the Georgian Bay area. Thank you.